Hi, I'm Kelsey Anderson with the Tigard Police Department, and this is our video newsletter for March 2023. It is one of our most popular events, and it is back. We're talking about the Community Academy, and registration is now open for our spring session. To sign up, just head to tiger-or.gov slash community academy and fill out the form there. We'll be meeting on Wednesday evenings for 10 weeks, starting on April 5th. The only requirements are that you either live or work in Tigard and are at least 16 years old. It's all free and we will provide dinner for you as well. It's a great way to get an inside look at your police department and connect with us in a low key personal setting. Registration closes on March 22nd at 1159 PM. So sign up quickly. Taking a look back at February, our detectives are in the early stages of a murder investigation. On the evening of February 22nd, a man called police to report the death of a woman. That man, Daniel Matthews, was arrested in the case. The victim, Tori Smith, died of strangulation. Matthews is now in jail. In another serious case, we responded to an armed robbery at Tiger Bowl on February 13th, where a man with a gun demanded money and got away. Police believe he committed a second armed robbery in Beaverton a few hours later. He was safely arrested on several charges. In February, we also had a very successful chat with the chief at Summerfield, where 85 people came out to talk with Chief McAlpine and ask questions. And a big thank you to everyone for taking the time to come out. Taking a look at the numbers, in February, we responded to 2,501 calls for service between dispatched calls and self-initiated contacts. That's an average of 89 calls every day. Even in this recent snowstorm, where our officers were called to hazards, welfare checks, and traffic crashes all over the city. We hope you stayed safe and got to enjoy it a little. That's it for this month. Please connect with us on whatever social platform you use.